first, in order to become a speech language pathologist, a person begins at the undergraduate level and takes undergraduate courses. That then when the student is eligible for graduate study, the student engages in a lot of clinical practice and uh, takes more courses and completes a graduate degree in communication disorders. And um, once that is completed, they are eligible to begin a clinical fellowship year, which is a year of supervised employment, and the student is eligible to take the American Speech Language Hearing Association national exam. Once a person completes all of those requirements, they are then able to diagnose and treat people who have communication disorders, such as people who have perhaps had a stroke and have lost their ability to speak or communicate as a result of that, or people who have a, a stuttering problem or a fluency problem, uh, children who perhaps learn language a little bit later than children at the same age level, or people who pronounce their words in a way that makes it difficult for them to be understood. We have a fairly well-equipped speech and hearing center with eight treatment rooms that are also used for assessment and diagnosis. And all of these rooms have access to closed circuit television so that the supervisor may observe. And they all have access to an observation corridor so that the supervisor may observe without being seen by the client who knows that they're being observed but may be distracted by the presence of a uh, supervisor in the room. Our graduate students and, and some of our undergraduate students also do um, their work, uh, their practicum work here with clients who come to us uh, from a variety of places. They may come to us from the uh, university, they may be students in the university or family members of students at the university. We also have some contracts with some outside agencies that send all of their clients to us and a number of people just uh, find out about us in the yellow pages or through friends and uh, come to us for services.